Hi, I'm Heather Earnhardt. I'm the chef and owner of Tokeland Hotel, Washington State's oldest hotel since 1885. With The Wandering Goose, my restaurant in Seattle, um, COVID hit and you know, we're a breakfast place and had a line out the door from the day we opened till the day we closed and it was bittersweet because it was, you know, it's hard leaving Seattle, but it's too hard to keep open and my heart wasn't in it anymore. My heart was in Tokeland. You know, after 25 years there and, you know, I needed some more open space and wanted to get out of the city and go back to the country. I'm originally from North Carolina. I wanted my kids to be able to ride their bike down the street or go drop a crab pot down at the end of the pier and just experience that life that I had as a child being outside all the time, which a lot of kids don't have nowadays. Growing up in the South, you know, food is a big deal. You talk about what you're going to have for lunch while you're eating breakfast. You talk about what you're having for dinner or supper while you're eating lunch. So it, food is a constant thread that runs through Southerners. And it's a misnomer. People think that Southern food is unhealthy. It's mostly vegetables. You know, Southerners couldn't afford good cuts of meat or expensive steaks. It was mostly centered around your garden and what you were growing. And then maybe you would have some fried chicken or maybe a pork chop, but mostly what you ate was vegetables and fish that was that you could catch yourself. Here at the Tokeland Hotel, we use only sustainable seafood, only what's in season. So if someone comes in and it's not crab season, we don't have crab. Razor clams, if they're not out being caught, it's, it's not on the menu. You have enough things out here to choose from where you can keep seafood on your menu throughout the year in a sustainable way. Something that customers can rely on that's always on the menu is ground fish, and it's we can get it year-round. You might not be able to have salmon year-round, but you have Black cod, super buttery, really hard to overcook. You've got ling cod, petrale sole, dover sole, rockfish. Yeah, rockfish sandwich, rockfish and grits, fish and chips. What can you not do with rockfish? <laughs> not just seafood, but you know, having working with local farmers and my job as a chef is to really make sure that that happens and maybe it costs a little more, maybe it takes a little more time to prepare or you know, but in turn, we're supporting other families. We're supporting a working fishing family, you know, that have, they've been fishing together for generations. And I take it really seriously. I think the hotel reflects, you know, our personality and, you know, my sense of style with, you know, I like furs and Persian carpets and taxidermy and warmth and candles and dim lighting and we live here we live on the third floor so when someone walks in and i greet them show them around and show them their room and i tell them like our home is your home so have fun and relax and laugh loud and have you know an extra cocktail or two and let all that city life behind and just learn to relax and enjoy life and watch the birds and see the sunrise and see the sunset and you know, it's important for all of us to slow down, especially in this last 18 months of everything we've been through. It's nice, this is a place where you can leave all that behind when you walk in the door. I'm so happy, got me singing la la la. What are we gonna do when you guys leave? We're gonna miss you guys so much. You're gonna have to come back.